the transformation and the progression of your life will ultimately be determined by what you do with those cards that you've been dealt. Your impact on this world will ultimately stem from how you operate within that hand that was ultimately given to you. There are so many people out there that have just settled, that have just settled um, because it was comfortable, settled because it was normal. Um, it was just what got easy. Uh, what got they got used to doing um, and again what was comfortable you guys know that have seen any of my stuff for any period of time one of my favorite phrases in the world is that if you seek comfort the world will deliver you pain but if you seek pain which means if you seek discomfort the world will deliver you pleasure and it's just a fact um, and so many people they get comfortable and they just they just stay there and that's just not, that's just not how we're supposed to live on this, on this earth. Um, I, I just truly believe that we were put on this planet um, to make an impact and to live up to our God-given talents, abilities, um, skills, and, and, and to live up to our potential. Starting with something that you do not possess will always lead to frustration. Judging your purpose, judging your potential on the wrong purpose will always lead to frustration. But our gifts are God-given, possessed without question. So that's where we start. I feel like so many people are walking through life, coasting through life as if they've got unlimited hands to play, as if they've got unlimited chances to do this thing called life over. And they don't realize that we only get one shot. We only get one chance at life. And it's about how we are able to become a better version of ourselves. How are we able to, you know, increase our skill set and our abilities and learn new things so that that hand that we are dealt starts to look better and better and better. How often are you pushing yourself to your, in parentheses, I put self-imposed and we'll talk about that, but your limits. It's easy to discuss this in terms of physical um, you know, fitness because that's the easiest thing we all know. You push yourself real hard, hit that limit, exhaust yourself physically. But it's in every area of your life. And specifically, I wanna talk about in business. How often are you pushing yourself to the limit? And the reason I say self-imposed because every limit you have is self-imposed because we're all given a set of circumstances we're all given certain skills talents abilities we're also given certain um things that we're going to have to overcome and i think it's through overcoming those things and it's through taking ownership of the hand that we're dealt and saying hey this is my situation but here's what i'm going to do about it it is in that process that we ultimately determine who we really are Reality, the majority of people will die having lived a life of mediocrity. Is that the legacy that you want? If you died today, what gifts would die with you?